In Game 6 of the NBA Finals, it is now at the 7-14 mark. The game is tied 14-14, evenly matched so far. San Antonio holds a 3-2 series edge. If they win this game, they will be NBA champions. With a little over three minutes left in the first quarter, San Antonio holds a 22-19 point lead, and Tim Duncan is looking fantastic. During commercial break, I am watching my beloved Detroit Tigers taking on the Baltimore Orioles. They're losing 5-2 in the eighth inning. At the end of the first quarter, Miami has the lead 27-25, even though San Antonio is shooting 61% from the floor. Miami started off the second quarter with a three-pointer, that is their fifth of the game. At the 9-14 mark, Miami is holding a six-point lead. Another commercial, and Baltimore still leads the Tigers, 5-2. Congratulations goes out to the Grand Rapids Griffins, who just defeated Syracuse, for the Calder Cup. That is hockey, in case you didn't know. Duncan is now 8 for 8 in the game, although San Antonio trailed by 3, with 6-10 to go in the second quarter. Chris Anderson, is such a lively player, but all those tattoos makes me shake my head. Mario Chalmers of Miami is having a good game himself. He has 14 points. In case you're interested, Baltimore defeated the Tigers 5-2. Manu Gino Belli has got to get it going for San Antonio. Not a very impressive first half. It is now halftime. San Antonio leads 50-44. Tim Duncan has 25 of those points. Lebron James also had a decent first half, but after Chalmers, he seems to be all that Miami has got. On a personal note, I think Chris Bosch may be the most overrated player in the NBA. As a second as begins, both teams are trading buckets. With 7.47 to go in the third quarter, San Antonio holds on to a five-point lead. Miami has just gone on a 12-4 run and is now just a single point behind. Tony Parker at this point is just 3 of 10 from the field, and has 6 assists. San Antonio has just wrapped back with 5 straight points, as Miami has just called a timeout. In other news, the police are questioning New England Patriots tight end Aaron Hernandez, in regards to a murder. I hope he has no involvement, in this very serious situation. The San Antonio Spurs has just went on an 11-0 run, and now leads 68-56. Tim Duncan continues to be playing phenomenally. Tim Duncan now has 30 points, compared to Lebron James' 12. Tony Parker has also picked up his play. Miami just seems so out of sync at the moment, they'd better get their heads back in the game. With one minute to go in the third quarter, San Antonio holds a 12-point lead. James made two free throws at the end of the third, but Miami still trails by 10. Let's face it, Lebron is gonna have to have a quarter of a lifetime against an experienced team. Miami has started the final quarter off fifth with six straight points, as Mike Miller drained a three with only one shoe on. Quite humorous if you were watching. Manu Gino Belli has yet to make an impact in this game. However, the same could be said for Dwayne Wade. Lebron James is on fire, with 6.03 left in the game. Miami now has a two-point lead. San Antonio just called timeout. Miami has outscored San Antonio 19-7 so far. So many commercial breaks, it drives me up a wall. Lebron is now 5-4-6 in the quarter. Make that 6-4-7 as Miami now has a three-point lead. Tony Parker is struggling as well, is now 4 out of 16 from the field. With under three minutes to go, San Antonio has only scored nine points. Tony Parker just nailed a three to tie it at 89 all. With 54 seconds to go, Parker just nailed another shot. Lebron just made a turnover, and Gino Belli hit two free throws, 
to give San Antonio a four-point lead. LeBron James shot an air ball, and San Antonio just made one of two free throws for a five-point lead. LeBron hit a three-pointer with 20 seconds left. Leonard is fouled. He misses the first but made the second. Ray Allen appeared to have made a three-point shot. It is under review, but looks good. It is. We are now going to overtime. What a game. San Antonio scores first. With 2.30 to go, San Antonio hold a one-point lead 199. Lebron just scored. Naturally another commercial. Danny Green made a spectacular defensive play and stripped Lebron of the ball. Ray Allen just hit two free throws. There is under two seconds left in the game. Miami leads by three. Game over.